Hello again, everybody. Welcome back to Polly's Pantry. I'm Polly Pitch, and today we're going to do something not so ho hum. We're making, we've got a little five ounce tenderloin here that we're going to pair with a Wisconsin old school classic here, a supper club mushroom. Uh, there were, oh boy, about a half a dozen places that would make these. Now we're down to about three, and it's a really delicious mushroom that we're going to saute in butter herb, white wine, a little bit of anchovy. Really, really wake it up. Um, as we're kind of warming up here, I've got about a half a stick of butter, a couple of cloves of garlic, some nice fresh thyme, and a little bit of sage. Again, a sage I found in a poultry mix of herbs that I bought at the store. And I want this to just kind of steep a little bit. I don't want it to melt right away. I'm gonna throw in just a dash of vegetable oil. Again, our vegetable oil is going to help the butter not burn so quickly. And what I'm trying to do is just kind of flavor the butter. We've got your store variety uh, button mushrooms, some nice small button mushrooms. And as I clean them, save the stems. And then we've talked about this a couple of times before. Hang on to those stems. That's going to really elevate your soups, really elevate your stock if you're making a risotto. Uh, throw them in the freezer and it really, really helps bring some complexity, bring some depth to the dish. Um, before we get going, thank you again for tuning in. We are over uh, pushing 2,200 views, about 120 people on Facebook, a couple of people on Twitter. Uh, you'll find the recipe for these mushrooms down below in the comments right after you subscribe and hit the little bell so you don't miss any of our videos here. So don't forget to like and subscribe. Tell your friends, tell your neighbors. Tell everybody that you're digging Polly's Pantry and learning some cool new recipes. Um, I'm not going to waste a whole lot of time or spend a whole lot of time talking about cooking a steak. If you flip through YouTube, there's got to be literally a thousand people that are going to tell you how to cook the steak. Uh, again, just a little five ounce uh, store-bought filet here. Not the $38, $40 a pound steer stuff. Uh, just a regular steak. Um, I've had it out on this plate on the counter good 20 minutes. You want to get all the cold spots out of it. Not exactly room temperature, but kind of warm enough. That's going to help it cook a little bit more evenly. I got my cool little stove top griddle here, uh, warming up and getting ready to go. Our butter is melted really, really nicely. And we're going to crank up the flame here and get things working. As we do this, and add in just oh, a spoonful of the anchovy oil and one. I can get them here. About three fillets. I know what you're thinking. I don't like anchovies. Please don't turn me off. <laughs> you can leave the anchovies out of this if you'd like and just do the butter, the Worcestershire, the garlic, the white wine. So as we're cooking here, again, we want to get things going just a little bit. And this anchovy is going to melt into everything and give it a nice, salty, kind of hot bite. Put my mushrooms in, cap side down. So I'm going to brown them. And again, we're going in a pattern so we know where we started. Whether it's clockwise, whether it's counterclockwise, whether it's up the side or down, doesn't really matter. All right. Shrooms are in there. I'm just going to let them cook. I want the mushrooms to brown a little bit, and then we're going to really pop the flavor on so. Nice hot pan. That butter's going to brown really nicely. That's just enough time. I got a little fried with me today. Um, really nice Pinot Noir to kind of keep me company as I'm rocking out these videos. Okay. Cooking it really nicely. Again, you see nice browning on those mushrooms. It smells ridiculous. Um, I dated a gal for a while. And I would make these for her. She just adored them. She eat. I have to make like a dozen for her, and just a couple for me. Uh, I think the only thing she liked about me 
What is these mushrooms? Uh, but that's another story for another time. So we've got our mushrooms, the cap kind of brown. Got that herb in there, got that garlic in there. I wish you could smell this. It is ridiculous. Good. Tablespoon of Worcestershire sauce. Say it with me. Gotta have the shorty. A little bit of white wine. Just because I can. And I'm gonna let this go with just a touch. Just reduce a little bit. You can see the incredible color. And then the aroma is just um, to die for here. The anchovies are already melted. And again, it's going to give it a nice, salty, nice, hot, a little bit of almost like a uh, pepper flake type of flavor. So I'm going to turn my big burner off. Turn my little back burner on here. And it's just barely on which is fine. And then we're gonna cover this up and let those be as we do our little filet. Again, I'm not gonna spend a whole lot of time on cooking a steak. There's a million uh, there are people better than me out there and a lot of different uh, ways to do this here. We'll let this go about three minutes aside. And we'll come back and finish our dish. Okay, we are back. I think we're ready to wrap up a little short video here on the anchovy mushrooms. Again, thanks again for tuning in. We really appreciate it. Uh, pushing 2,200 views in about five months, which is uh, pretty good. Never thought we'd get that far. So we've got our little filet here. About three minutes aside. Real simple little cook. Just salt and pepper. Nice little char in that. Our little grill here. Our mushrooms have just been steeping in that beautiful jus that we made here. Make sure you can see what I'm doing. And all I'm gonna do, just kind of place them as a accompaniment, as an enhancer to our steak here. Works with anything with New York, um, a ribeye, anything along those lines. There you see what we've got going on here. It should be a little bit of a better picture there. There we go. And again, but I wish you could smell these. I mean, very savory, beautiful, beautiful flavor, beautiful color. And just a piece of our filet here. And again, simple medium rare cook. Again, three minutes aside, and then a little bit of mushroom. Mm. Really pops the steak, gives it a nice flavor. Um, I would serve a little bit of the jus on the side, a little bit of the butter on the side, kind of like an au jus uh, type of a deal. But that about wraps it up for another little short video. Uh, today we made an old school Wisconsin classic, a supper club mushroom with or without anchovies. Don't forget, you don't have to if you don't want to. That's been Polly's Pantry for today. Thanks again for tuning in. We'll see you down the road real soon. Straight night.